message came from the internet. Oh, right, Brandy. What's the story? What's going on? We're going to head to Nor- North Fo- Norfolk, Virginia, where two men hijacked a parked car there, only to discover that an eight-year-old boy was sitting in the back seat. Whoa. They were a little surprised, obviously. They talked to the boy, said, well, what's going on? Where are you going? He says, well, I have to go to school. So the two guys that hijacked the car took him to school. <laughs> when p- police uh, were called, obviously, uh, the mom, curious as to where the child was, had the police search. They found the boy in his classroom at his elementary school, apparently unfazed by the whole affair. Wow, that's awesome. His mom's cell phone was left in the car, so police had no trouble tracking the car with GPS, but the hijackers and the kidnappers were gone. The mom, though, might be facing charges because she left her son in the car with the engine running. Think how excited that kid was. Like, whoa, this is going to be rad. Like, I don't know who these guys are. Am I getting kidnapped? Oh, I still have to go to school? Oh, come on, man. What's going on? This is a great opportunity for a kid's show. Like the the hosts pretend to put show? yeah the hosts pretend to put the kids in uh, terrifying situations in order to teach them lessons you know like this one they get in the car and like they just peel out and the kids like whoa, 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 what's going on well kid see Billy it's important to never leave your car unlocked with the keys in it and then drop them <laughs> off at school while running yeah and here's an apple just to make sure you get all your vitamins like another one Billy is sleeping and a guy in a ski mask with a knife wakes him up pulls his mask up. See, Billy, it's important to keep your doors and windows locked. Maybe even invest in a security system. Billy walks into a room one day. You know, the guy's, like, quickly copying down uh, Billy's mom's credit card info from her purse. Hey, are you trying to teach me a lesson about uh, credit card fraud? What? No, kid, I got taken to the cleaners in my divorce and I owe 80 grand in student debt. You tell anybody about this and I'll chop you up and feed you to my iguana. 